I want to see. All right, Halloween is over, and for some people, myself included, that means the Christmas decorations are already up. It's my wife's fault, I promise. But are you ready for the holidays? Paige is here with some help. Paige. Yeah, I know. I'm not sure what Jennifer would have to say about that. <laughs> but Jennifer Durbin does join us now, the clueless chick. She's here with some tips for incorporating new, fun, and really simple traditions into your holidays. I love this because everybody loves to have things that they look back on at, the, at their childhood of, you know, we used to always do this. And these are some great ways that you can do that with your kids. Yeah, very simple, very inexpensive. Yes. So the first idea here is to get some plain placements before Thanksgiving in some fabric pens and then right before dinner you can have everyone write what they're thankful for this year or if you have little ones they can decorate a corner and then put the placemat in a safe place and bring it out next year and then you can add to it every year what you're thankful for so such great conversation pieces for that too and you say this can be either with a placemat or a or a full tablecloth full tablecloth that would be fun as well and it's nice if it's fabric as opposed to like a butcher block because then you can keep it for years to come Tip for making that work best in terms of what type of pen and, and placemat you get? Really any fabric pen will work well. You don't want to immediately throw it in the washing machine, so make sure you're reading the instructions on the pen about how to make sure that the ink sets properly. Okay, and then this is cute if you want to kind of get more hands-on and give somebody something homemade. Yeah, so especially if you've got family across the country that you won't be able to visit for the holidays, send them this little do-it-yourself cookie basket. So include some bags of cookie mix, you know, some cookie cutters, and some frosting and that way as a family they can make cookies for the holiday and maybe they'll even send you a few yeah <laughs> so it'll be a gift back to yes, you also and this is also the perfect hostess gift so if you're oh, going to holiday parties idea. put this together and take it with you brilliant brilliant and this way is a way for the kids to kind of get into the spirit and count down to the holidays also tell us about the advent calendar yeah so this is a fun do-it-yourself advent calendar that you can make especially for grandparents who aren't close by so you create this advent calendar and then and include a picture of the little ones throughout the year and every day they can remove one of the numbers and see another picture of your little ones and then if you're really crafty and have the time have them return the calendar to you next year and you can refill it with pictures make from it next with year. new ones yeah. love it all of these ideas will be on our website wncn.com we will link the video as well as well as on the clueless chick website clueless jennifer as usual lovely ideas thanks for coming Thank in you. thanks for having me